What's up, sports bettors? FanDuel is offering this pretty cool no sweat same game parlay for Thursday night football. For me, I can get a free bet up to $5 if I place a same game parlay and it loses. If it wins, obviously I get all those winnings. So for those of you using FanDuel, I would make sure to log into your account, check the promos and see what they are offering you because I have seen people with higher amounts than this one with more than $5 that FanDuel will refund you. For me, they're only giving me five bucks, but that's okay. Basically, the way it works is you place a three or more leg same game parlay in the Thursday night football game tomorrow between the Steelers and the Browns. As long as the odds are plus 400 or longer, which basically, as I tell you, plus 450, plus 500, qualify, plus 350, don't. As long as you meet all of those qualifications, you place a bet and that bet loses you will get that refunded. For me, up to $5. For you, it might be higher. Just keep in mind that in order to be able to um, opt into this, you actually have to click opt in, and then it has to be the first bet you place. So if I go to bet now, and I go to the Steelers versus Browns game, you click same game parlay just to make sure that you are um, getting everything that is locked in for a same game parlay and you are good to go. So that is the first step for this same game parlay. The next thing that you need to do, obviously find plays to put into the same game parlay. For me, I like using odds jam to find sharp mathematically profitable bets. It's pretty cool. So starters um, in the positive EV page, this page provides betting opportunities where you are getting uh, an edge on the sports book. Every bet you place has an edge over the sports book. In this case, we have filtered it for FanDuel. I also have filtered it specifically for the Pittsburgh Steelers game. So the first leg of this same game parlay is going to be Mitchell Trubisky over 199 passing yards. Admittedly, that makes me a little bit nervous. So I need to go to alt passing yards. So it should be 200 plus. Perfect. Should be plus 102. Perfect. So admittedly, that does make me a little bit nervous because Trubisky has been horrible through two games, but the Browns have been getting smoked their first two games in the air. They let up a 75-yard touchdown to um, Robbie Anderson and Baker Mayfield in week one. Last week, they got torched by Joe Flacco in the Jets. So maybe Mitchell Trubisky can have that in him. So that's one way to find profitable plays. You just go to the positive EV page. The next thing that you can do is if you go to sports, you click NFL, it pulls you up to this odds page, right? And then if you open this up in a new tab, it pulls up all of the lines for this game. So totals, spreads, everything like that. So you can start looking at all the markets. So what I have up here is the rushing yardage for Najee Harris to go over 52 and a half. So this technically won't show up on a positive expected value bet, but look where every other book pretty much prices his rushing yards at. Literally every other book has it above this amount, except for prize picks. But like Underdog has it at 54 and a half. WinBet, typical, Bet Rivers at 53 and a half. And WinBet actually is favoring the over at that full yard higher at minus one. They have it at minus 125 at 53 and a half. Then we have Odds Jam, Pinnacle, the sharpest sports book in the world, pricing it at 54 and a half. Points Bet, having it at 55 and a half, a full three yards higher. So basically, every single sports book is telling you Najee Harris should go over 52 and a half rushing yards, basically between 52 and 55. So you could also middle this if you wanted to. You could check out the uh, Odds Jam middles tool to find a profitable middle opportunity for this game. I'm sure they're going to be some. So there's rushing yards for Trubisky, and there's the first half total points you can middle as well. I'm looking to put in bets for a same game parlay, so this will be my second leg is Najee Harris over 52 and a half rushing yards. So let me go ahead and add this one. So Najee Harris has been added. So I have these two, Trubisky 200 plus passing yards, Najee Harris over 52 and a half. The next positive EV play I found was Steelers plus four and a half at minus 115, putting this same game parlay at plus 455. So I'll just put the um, max amount that they'll uh, give me back, which is five bucks. Normally, sometimes it's 25, sometimes it's 50. In this case, it's only five, but five to win 22, not breaking the bank, but still pretty cool. So I will put this as my same game parlay, no sweat, same game parlay for tomorrow. Let me go ahead and lock this in and we are good. So we're looking at Mitch Trubisky, 200 plus passing yards, Najee Harris over 52 and a half rushing yards and Steelers plus four and a half.
And that's it. So appreciate you guys watching. Recommend locking this one in. Just make sure that you go to promos and that you actually see accepted. You go and opt in and just bet the max amount that they'll allow you. For me, it was five bucks. For other people, it might be higher. Just make sure that you are finding profitable plays to put in that same game parlay. For me, I used Odd Jam, found three sharp bets, but that's it. So appreciate you guys watching. Enjoy the gross Thursday night football game we have tomorrow and have a good one.